So the home, it means like the person itself, the family. When you leave the house, you live with the family, with the persons, with your memories. The loss of a home can fracture a family, its identity, and it can have grave impact on their safety, health, prosperity, emotion, and well-being. Often people are separated from their communities, loved ones, and support, and networks. Climate change and urbanization is just going to add to the numbers of people in inadequate housing. For those who have no safety nets, a temporary crisis can change the trajectory of their lives for years to come. Today, we have 100 million people forcibly displaced or lost their homes. We are contributing what we can, but what can do as one is a drop in the ocean. Gitu pak intinya, kok kaget sekarang alhamdulillah gitu maksudnya. Bisa tidur nggak sampai bekas tuh, sampai nyaman gitu maksudnya. How can we contribute to a system to be more effective and inclusive? It's about being collaborative and working together and not competing. Most of the time, we don't have to, to have all this expertise that we need, but we can always reach out to other organizations and stakeholders. Habitat and CRS, we work together as a partners. We filling the gap from each other organization. Scale meaning not only expanding the impact of our delivery uh, program, but also uh, how that impact or how that learning and that strategy are adopted by others. CRS uh, operating in Indonesia based on memorandum of understanding with Ministry of Social Affairs that make it easier for us to process all the documentations for the communities. If community needs support in paperwork, for example, of building permits, this will speed up the process with the government because that relationship with the government. We're building on the direct housing support we already provide by tapping into local market systems through banks, construction companies, home building suppliers, and others working in the housing industry. If you're going to do something in our city, it makes sense for us to all work together so we don't have silos and we don't have people work going off on their own agendas. That way we get maximum benefit for our residents and the real possibility of the transformative change that we want. So what's really important in Greece is not just to design and implement another housing project, but to actually uh, take a next step and influence um, the policy around housing. In partnership with the government of Greece, we offer monthly cash allowance. CRS was one of the leading agencies to advocate for cash-based support for asylum seekers. What we're trying to do is work in partnership with, in our case in Greece, the government and say, what are the policies that could really help uh, you to meet the affordable housing needs and how can that be tailored to meet the needs of refugees? We saw the impact of this type of work in Bangladesh, where we worked with our local partner, Caritas Bangladesh, to formulate designs and guidelines for the Rohingya refugee response. It incorporated consideration for privacy, hygiene, individual ability to personalize and upgrade their structures. This created the feeling of home. Furthermore, this approach was adopted by the United Nations and the government and will be replicated across the whole settlement 
and throughout the country when a crisis hits next. Sometimes you just need a spoon or two of a catalytic agent um, because it doesn't get consumed in the reaction. It keeps on generating a reaction. We just need the right mindset and approach to really catalyze a change in, in a public system. We have to be supporting a system which can enable people to be more resilient. And we all have a place in the solution.